the idea of marriage was not created by man, but by the Lord. It's as if Becca and Josh were waiting for each other. It's as if all the prayers from Chuck and Denise and Dolores and Art for their children's spouse are all being answered in this very moment. And I just want to encourage you, you two, keep Jesus as the foundation of this marriage, as the foundation of relationship, and you'll be able to build something strong and long-lasting. Standing here, I'm still in awe of God and how faithful he has been to us through all the times. This incredible journey that he has sent us on has led us all to this moment and to this time where we become one before the Lord and we make a promise in front of our family and our friends to love one another from now into our eternity. I love you, Becca. And even before we met, my heart was yours. It longed for you and now it beats together with yours. Josh. <laughs> Anyone who knows me knows how indecisive I am. <laughs> However, the decision to become your wife has certainly been the easiest, most confident decision I have ever made. Um, you make it easy to fall in love with you. Uh, your joy for life is undeniable and it's contagious. You care deeply and you love fiercely. Your heart is sincere and kind. The love you show me is what I've always prayed for in a life partner and you're the man God has led me to. I promise to hold our love in such a way that nothing can ever tear it apart. I promise to love you with a Christ-like love that is patient, gentle, loving, and a love that always forgives and never holds against. Today I vow to put God first in our marriage, to point our relationship to his word and to his promises. I vow to stand with you through the best of times and the worst. I promise to be your husband and the father of our children that God has called me to be and to lead his family as a man of God. My heart is forever and eternally yours, and from this day forward, I promise to marry you, not just today, but every day. So with these rings and all these witnesses, take these promises into forever as we grow our love together. I vow to encourage you to be your biggest fan and always fight for us, to love you faithfully and unconditionally. And I vow to choose you every day for the rest of my days. I love you.
Josh and Becca, I, I could not have handpicked anybody. I mean, you would have been on top. I mean, you have just been such a blessing. And you just, you make her so happy. It's, you know, we talked when you asked me if you could marry her. You know, I told her, I told you, I said, you know, I, you know, I, as long as you will always, you know, take care of my little girl, as long as you will always come home and don't forget us, and, um, and, and every, you read everything, and the thing is, I believe everything you say because you're a godly person. You, you know, you serve the Lord first, and you, I know you, my daughter loves you to death. <laughs>